right, in this video I'm going to work out an individual integral. It's going to be, um, after some algebra manipulation, it'll be a basic U substitution integral, which would be done typically in a Calc 1 class. All right, now because I've got this 1 over x to the third as an exponent, and then I've got an x to the fourth in the denominator, what I'm going to do is I'm going to algebraically manipulate this, all right, using some laws of exponents just to make this a little bit easier. Okay, so I don't want um, a fraction, so I'm going to move this x to the fourth up and make the four negative, loss of exponents. I'm going to do the exact same thing there with that exponent on the e. So I'm going to have an e raised to the x to the negative 3. All I did was take the x to the third, move it to the top, make it negative. That's a law of exponents. All right, and then this one comes up, and I'll have the x to the negative 4. Okay, so basic algebra manipulation there before I even start the integral. All right, now at this point, I've got to pick my u, make a decision for what my u is going to be. All right, um, and if you're thinking ahead here, I've got to let it be that x to the negative third, third, because then when I take the derivative, I'll have an x to the negative four. Okay, so I'm going to let u be x raised to the negative third. And then when I take the derivative of both sides over here, then I'll have a negative 3x to the negative 4 dx. And that's what I want since I've got that x to the negative 4 sitting there. I'm going to go ahead and solve all the way down for dx. So I'll have a du over a negative 3x to the negative 4. Okay, and then I'm going to come up and I'm going to start doing some substituting. Okay, I'm going to have the integral. All right, I let u be that x to the negative third, so I'm going to write this as an e to the u. All right, I'm going to keep the x to the negative 4. All right, this dx I'm going to re replace with what it equals, so then I'm going to have a du over a negative 3 x to the negative 4. All right, hopefully then that lets you see that those x to the negative fours can cross out really easily. All right, I've got that imaginary one in the front right there, so I can pull out a negative one-third. So I'm going to pull that out in front, a negative one-third, integral of e to the u du. Okay, pretty standard integral in a Calc 1 class. We should have this memorized. When you integrate e to the u, you get e to the u. So then I'm going to have a negative one-third e to the u plus c. All right, now I want to replace u with what it equals so that I can get it back in terms of x, since my original problem was in terms of x. So negative one-third e raised to the x to the negative third plus c. And then there's nothing wrong with the answer. You could stop right there. Or since you did not have any negative exponents to begin with, you could go ahead and change that back. So you've got a negative one-third e raised to the one over x to the third plus c. All right, both of those um, are equivalent answers. It just depends on if you want to make it kind of look like what you originally started with. Definitely a straightforward uh, u substitution integral with just a little algebra manipulation to make it easier, but typically found in a Calc 1 class. Definitely thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, please share with your friends, and um, don't forget to give me a thumbs up whenever possible. Thanks.